One person was shot in the Garden Hills community in Champaign this evening. Neighbors say they sprung into action to help treat the person. Fox Illinois' Evan Hensley shares why one of those neighbors said he had to help. Evan? And police here in Champaign responded to a shooting that took place around the intersection here of Paula and Joanne in Champaign, where neighbors say it happened sometime after 5 o'clock this evening. I spoke with one man who was pulling up to his home when it happened, and then the neighbors sprung into action. To see someone shot in, in my front yard, um, for to me, is no apparent reason, is uh, it's hurtful and disheartening. Logan Belcher was pulling up to his home after a long day at work when he heard a gunshot. Police say a person had been shot Wednesday afternoon around the intersection of Paula Drive and Joanna Lane in Champaign. I pulled up from work. My neighbor said someone got shot and uh, we immediately ran over there and just made sure he had a pulse, make sure we were talking to him and that was about all we did. Belcher says he and his neighbors rushed to treat the man who had been shot in the head and neck area and around 10 other neighbors responded to help the victim after it occurred. He said that he had had some training to help with a response like this. You know, I feel bad for him. I don't know the man. Um, what really helped was my military training. Um, you know, I I've unfortunately have been through situations like this, so I just immediately ran over and tried to help in any way I could and told certain people to call 911. It is a shooting that shocked the community. But Belcher says the rise in shootings over the last year has made everyone anxious, especially since it happened just outside his home in broad daylight. You know, it's a scary thought. Um, you never think that it's going to happen in your front yard at all. Um, but things like this happens and the world has evil people and I hope the person that did do this gets brought to justice and I hope for a full recovery on the, on the man that uh, was a victim in this. Still waiting to learn about the status of the victim as well as any, if any arrests have been made at this point. Once we do get more information, we will be there for sure. Share it for you through our website, foxillinois.com. Reporting live in Champaign, I'm Evan Hensley, back to you.